welcome to the Undertale neutral route. So, I was told by my friend Top Gun, uh, also known as Lunk, that the neutral route involves me killing all the non-essential characters. Howdy! I am Flowey, Flowey the Flower! Hehehe! <laughs> Why you make me introduce myself? It's rude to act like you don't know who I am. Someone ought to teach you proper manners. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. <clears throat> Your soul starts off weak, but you can grow strong if you gain lots of LV. What does LV stand for? Why, love, of course. Want some love, don't you? Don't worry, I'll share some with you. Wink. Down here, love is spread through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around and get as many as you can. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try this again. Nope. Is this a joke? Are, are you brain dead brought into the bulk friendliness palace, I mean? You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. Joy! <laughs> well, you played yourself. Sure you can! What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Do not be afraid, my child. I am Tokyo, caretaker of the rooms. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the ruin, through the catacombs. This way. Hashtag 30, rule 34, bait. Ah. Uh, we're going to kill pretty much anything that is not essential. And I do mean pretty much anything. Welcome to your first, to your new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of ruins. The ruins are full of puzzles, ancient functions between fusions between devices and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Press, please object yourself to the sight of them. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several levers. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. Good, good. That one? <laughs> Splendid! I'm proud of you, little one. Let's move to the next room. Oh good, I'm glad she's proud of me. Would be sad if she wasn't. Yeah, yeah. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this soon, this situation. However, worry not, the progress is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time, I will come to resolve the conflict. Per practice talking to the dummy. Okay, now if you just, if you act first, check the dummy. 
it'll do something odd. And then if you just do this a whole bunch. This isn't a set. I know I said I would be killing essential characters, but we don't even get EXP for this. And I'm pretty sure if we just kill this thing, this and attacking us, we go down the genocide route. Just saying. Yep. Dummy tired. <laughs> yep. He literally just took flight. Next room. I can't even look at the... The dummy won't even do anything when I click on it. Another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. The dummy's still there. Okay. Ah, this is why I'm talking about the frog itch. No! Well, at least I... It attacked me, so... Maybe that counted. If I can't figure out how to do the neutral ending, guys, then I will wind up doing a genocide route early. And that's what resetting is for. Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for now. And this is where she goes to go take a dump between the damn... Well, I'm, I'm just tired of reading this, to be honest. There's nothing new, so... She had to take a big Chipotle shit behind the pillar. All that music is literally just her farting. See, now that it, now that we got to the damn pillar, she stopped farting because she's done taking a big Taco Bell-like dump. Scratch that Chipotle dump. You only get you only have to take a Taco Bell dump when you um, eat one of those beans. They're they're weird beans, and it feels like you're gonna die. And... There. Wow, that frog, it just ran. Okay, it says I can spare him now. I mean, I'm not going to be killing them if I... If, if, if they don't want to fight anymore, then I'm just going to spare them, you see? There's no point not to. I'm just going to fight them until they don't want to fight me anymore. Wow, I got out of that easily. Enough. Now. I spare you. And I'm just fighting all these frogets. Which I believe a froggit is the blend between a cat. Well, I wasn't paying attention and scared myself when I killed that thing with a stick. Note to self, don't hit. Don't get a perfect hit this time. It should be low enough for it to surrender. Anything else? 
I guess it's not attacking me. Console. As long as we're not attacking everything, like, all the time. It's like... Sometimes. Hello, this is Tony. Blah, 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 butterscotch. No, blah, blah, blah. Cinnamon, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I'm turning dark in this episode. This puzzle makes me fucking upset to my fucking stomach. Because I fucking hate it. Okay. Then down, up, and then down, then up. Okay. Up, down, up. I have not been hit yet. Almost got hit there. Anyway, I think the thing is, if I just gain like a little bit of love, maybe it won't be so bad. Solved it. Only two holes. You're gonna watch me kill this fucking monster. Dodging. Okay. You I spare. Sometimes I wish we could just break this stupid rock. That rock is a jackass, anyway. Now, Nob's to block to be like a pacifist. I guess we cheer him up. He's an essential character, after all. Cheer. Sorry, I'm just really not feeling up to it. Right now. Wow, you literally made tears into a hat. It's great. Wow. That come to the underground, but you found somebody really nice. come in handy. I wish I hadn't read that before, but I was trying to fucking figure it out before. But the tutorial frog it is gone, probably when I killed that one. Okay, now these things, I'm supposed to kill at least one of those creatures. The Vegetoids, yeah, the Vegetoids. I'm pretty sure. And again, they're not an essential character, so I could probably kill them. All that I wanted. Now, mind you, my friend Lunk told me this. Known as Top Gun, so if anything goes wrong, we can go... We can go yell at him. It does feel nice being able to kill things, I'm not gonna lie. I deserve that, because...
because I said it felt nice killing things. You see, children, when you hurt things, you have to you have to feel the consequences for thine actions. Got some of my health back and devoured him. You see, you can literally devour these creatures. They're quite delicious. And I'd say that I'm pretty good at dodging. Wouldn't you guys say that? There. Yeah, he's doing nothing but vibe, and I'm gonna let him go. This thing gets to die. And he will never know why. And one more time for the homie DJ Screw. A boink! We had tasty EXP, buddy. I fell down a hole, now I can't get back up. Go on without me. Wait, ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh well. Saddest creature that I've seen since I walked to this place and they slowed sold clones of me. Wait, that place sold mirrors. See what I did there? Hashtag Bohambo. That dude was funny as fuck. Worst case scenario, I have to go all the way back here and fight some more monsters. Oh! Looks... Looks is gonna go down first. I think they're seeing me as an actual threat now. Dodge. Dodge. Okay, so Vegetoid isn't weak enough for me to eat yet. And... Dodge, sorry guys, I'm quiet so much. It's just that I don't want to get hurt. I mean, this isn't a no-hit-run, as you can clearly fucking see, because I'm getting hit, but I'm trying to literally not get hit at all. I'm not sure if eating Vegetoid kills it, so I'm not sure we get any EXP for it. Maybe that's the last door. No, it's not. It's clear the one that isn't obscure. Yeah. Yeah, I was wrong. Well, now I get to walk through all these rooms. Lovely. Lovely, lovely, lovely. I'm good. I'm gonna name this episode trying to do the neutral route. I hate this room. I hate it. I absolutely hate it. The entire reason I want to do the neutral route, not the genocide route, uh, second is because, well, I want to get all the endings before I fuck up my game forever. Ooh, let's get the knife. This will make things a little bit easier.
I mean, we're still going to be sparing things every now and again. Let's eat our piece of candy so Mom thinks we're capable. Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. Than I thought it would. Bring me- wait, what? How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? Not a scratch? Impressive, but still. I should have not left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try surprising you like this. Eh, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come along, small one. Or else you'll be sent to Hoboken. Do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie. I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I wanted to wait. I wanted you to have a nice lifetime here. Life living here. So I will hold off on the snail pie for tonight. Here, another surprise for you. Mm. This is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. I smell something burning. Um, make yourself at home. I have the feeling that, um, there's an ending where we could kill Toriel, but I don't want to do that now. But then again, maybe I could literally almost kill her. Because, well, she would be attacking me. You're up. Let's see. Blah, blah, blah. Stuff about stuff that I don't care about. Blah, blah, blah. I've been through down this road before. Oh, accidentally misclicked. And... She has to do something, so do we. She moves so fast. Like zippity zoom. You wish to return. You wish to know how to return home, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I am going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now, be a good child and go upstairs. It's sad. Really, she's just trying to protect us in her own right. If every human that falls down here meets the same fate, I have seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I am only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. Do not try to stop me. This is your last warning. You want to leave so badly. <laughs> you are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove yourself to me. You are strong enough to survive. I don't want to have to do this. Fuck. Damn. Damn, that hurt. I don't want to have to do this to you! Besides, you're an essential character. Talk. Couldn't think of a topic. I gotta dance with the fucking fire. burning me quite a bit. Easy. 
game wants me to drop her to enough HP that she could die, but I'm not going to kill her. Call me Sans dances with fire. A few more hits and I will wind up dying, so. I wonder what she'll do if she ends up killing me. She doesn't want to. No! You are stronger than I thought. Listen to me, small one. You go beyond this door. Keep walking as far as you can. Eventually you will reach an exit. Asgore, do not let Asgore take your soul. Plans allow can cannot be allowed to succeed. Be good, won't you, my child? I'm actually crying right now because I wasn't trying to do that. I was trying to lower her health. I thought she would give up. What are my stats at level 5? I might as well see what happens. Besides, I can always restart. I'm a terrible person. Zachary, if you're watching this, I did not mean to do that. You know that. I wasn't going to kill her until I reached the genocide route. Howdy! I hope you like your choice. After all, it's as if you're, you can go back... After all, it's not as if you could go back and change fate. In this world, it's kill or be killed. That old bat, that old hag thought she could break the rules. She tried so hard to save you humans. But when it came down to it, <laughs> she couldn't even save herself. What an idiot. Wow, he really, really likes to just grind the salt into the wound, doesn't he? Grind the salt into the wound, Flowey, by Toby Fox. I'm level 5 now. That's something. Oh, music. Weird music, and... Why'd that take so long to break? Hmm. Human, don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. <laughs> the old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It all, it's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans, Sans the Skeleton. 
I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now, but, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. My brother, now my brother on the other hand, the virus, he's a human hunting fanatic. He's actually, he actually, hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate, I think. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars way too wide to, to stop anyone. Well, actually, um, it might stop some people. Like, some really, really fat people. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. What's up, bro? You know what's up, brother. It's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. This lamp is really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human, then I, the great papyrus, will get all the things. Utterly dis- I utterly deserve- I deserve- like desire. Respect, recognition, I will finally be able to join the royal guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a- in- I will sh bathe in a shower of kisses. Every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans! You are not! You are such a lazy boat. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier each day. Hey, take it easy. I got a still a ton of work done today. A ton of work done today. A still a ton. <laughs> Sans! Come on! You're smiling. I am and I hate it! <sighs> Why does someone as great as me have to do so much just to get recognition? To get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. <laughs> ah! I will attempt... I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more a backbone into it. <laughs> I think he's gone. Wait. <laughs> okay, you can come out now. You can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back, and if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but do me a favor. I was thinking my brother has been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before. And seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million. I'll be a bad. Well, apparently I'm not doing the genocide route. Because it doesn't say determination. Ice cap. Oops. What's in the box? Tough glove. Let's equip tough glove. Better than the knife I have, right? That killed our mother and also that poor ice cap guy. Okay, let's act. Joke. 
Tell a joke. Okay, dodge, 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 dodge. Ow, my buddy! Why did you hurt me? I'm literally just telling jokes. I told a bad bud, and now you're gonna hurt me. Oh, dear God, why? The spinning blades of ice. It hurts my body and bones. Ow, my body and bones. I'm just sitting here crying as I moan. Ah! <laughs> Sorry. Maybe I'm laughing at the delirium of the pain that you just shot to my body. That's supposed to be funny. Delirium due to the pain of the ice blade you just shot to my body. Dickhead. I've heard better ones. Okay. Okay, eh, eh. This won't be funny either. I'm thinking about, I just fucking end him. That's what I'm thinking. Fighting, that's cold blood. He actually has told a joke. See? Laugh. Laughs. Dad was wrong. Yeah, I got him. I gave him what he wanted. Now if I get the same damn thing as earlier. So I was saying about undying. So that's what I was saying about undying. Do you see that? I see that. Do you see that? I see that. Do you see that? I see it. I can't believe what I'm seeing. Get, get the cat! Ah! I'm dizzy. Same. Size. Oh my god. Is that a human? <laughs> nah. Uh, uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Ow. Hey! What's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! He's... he's that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans! I finally did it! And I will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular, 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 popular! Ahem, you shall not pass this area! I, the great Papyrus, will stop you! I will then capture you! Advise to the capturing. Deliver to the cap the castle then then I am not sure what happens next. In any case, continue if you dare. <laughs> well well that went well. That went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Okay, I guess I have to stir him because he's given me the ability to. The next thing I'm killing. I mean, it's not mindless killing, it's actually quite mindful. Damn it. Why are you back? I- we literally had a talk! You- you dummy! I spared you and now you're about- you know what? You deserve it. You deserve it. Chill out. No. How about I chill in? Fighting you. Fights in you, cold-blooded. Well, I just leveled up to level 6. 
My love increased. Okay. No bad time. No bad time. Only dead time. Agreed. Unforgettable. I... I don't think... I don't thank you. I can't kill that thing. That was a cool looking creature right there. You looked so cool. And most of these things aren't even attacking me. Steel. Help. All I read there was help. You tried to steal Ice Cap Tap, but it's not weak enough. Help! Fashion Police! Dodge, dodge, dodge. Now I'm gonna steal your damn stupid hat. Oh, you tried stealing Snowcap's hat. You succeeded. It melts in your hands. So cold. Snowcap is no more. I didn't know that that, that its hat was that important. Now I feel bad. I turned him into an ice cube. It'd be more merciful if I just killed him in the first place. Hopefully, me being decisive like this. Okay, good. Decide not to call the number. I wonder if Flowey thinks that I'm literally someone else now. You know what? I killed you. I've done everything except repeat you in form snow cap that it has a great ad compliment. Fashion. You should want too bad. That's the one too bad. But, uh... Okay, he doesn't know what a compliment actually is, I don't think. So let's just ignore him. It seems defeated. This thing. So this thing is actually attacking me, so he's not all that essential of a character. You never, you'll never see it come, man. Moving, moving. And now that I've nearly defeated him, it says I can spare him, so that's what I'm gonna do. Because I'm not a killer. Something pet me and beat my ass and it didn't even move. <laughs> hey. Hey. Here's something to remember. Blue stop sign, blah, blah. Red stop sign, blah.
Yeah, I took his piece of snow. I'm not gonna do anything that mean to him. Yet. You were napping all night! Sam, you're so lazy, you were napping all night! I think that's called, um, sleeping. Excuses, excuses! Ha! Uh, oh, ho, ho! The human arrives in order to stop you. My brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking for you. See, this is the invisible electric maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, the orb will emit a healthy sap. Sounds like fun, because the amount of fun you will probably have is actually rather small, I think. <laughs> okay, you can go ahead now. Ow, my body and bones! Sans, what did you do? Uh, I think the human is supposed to hold that orb. Oh, okay. I'll just leave a path here for the human because I want to be a friend. Hold this, please! And run in and run in and in and run in and in. Okay, now try. Okay, I'm just gonna do this. Perfectly a little shock, but that don't matter none. Incredible, you slippery snail! You solved it so easily! Too easily. However, the next puzzle would be not as easy. It is designed by my brother. You will surely be confounded by it. I know I am. <laughs> hey, thanks. Thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? He made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. Of course it is. He won't. He hasn't worn anything else since. He calls his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yep. Hey, nice cream guy. I need some of your nice cream. I need some of your cream, okay? I need to eat it. I need health. Give me your damn health. Thank you. And one more for the homie DJ Cream. There. And... This should... Uh, I'm just playing with this snowball because I'm a small child. I'm a child! What do you expect? I get bored, I have a slow attention span. I'm a babby. Just a little itty bitty child. I haven't done anything wrong, not in my mind at least. There. Purple, even when you felt trapped, you took note and achieved the end of the ball. You have been awarded two gold. Wow. I've been thinking about selling treats to. Want some fried snow? Yeah. Did I say five gold? I meant fifty. Sure. Really? How about five thousand? But five hundred million. That's my final offer. What? You don't have. You don't have the money. Hey, that's okay. I don't have any fried snow. Okay, these are the dogs. I think I'm gonna wind up killing them because they're. Quite violent. I mean, they're not really essential characters. We only see them once at that point. Human, I hope you're ready for... Sans? Where the fuck is the puzzle? It's, uh, it's right there on the ground. It's right there on the ground, man. Trust me. There's no way they're going to be able to get past this. How do you have a pen? Sans! What did it? That didn't do anything! Whoops. I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is easily harder. 
the hearts. What? Really, though? That's easy peasy word jump word scrap. That's for baby ball. Unbelievable! Human, solve this debate. Which is harder, Junior Jump? <laughs> yes, humans must be very intelligent if they also if they also find Junior Jump so difficult. <laughs> Thanks for saying Junior Jumble was. Thanks for saying Junior Jumble, just to appease uh, my brother. Yesterday he stump, he got stumped trying to solve the horoscope. Wow. That look, he sounds like something I would do. Level six. That that's still a comfortable amount of help for level twenty, and we're still not doing the genocide route. So, yeah. <laughs> Now, this area, I'm going to walk around a bit. Lesser dog. I'm sorry, dog! Lesser asshole is more like it. I tried making friends with everyone, but no one wants to be my friend, really. I have no friends. I smell like an anus. I smell like an anus because I haven't bathed in years. Because I've been down here and I have a sweating disorder. So I smell bad. I smell horrible. Wonder what would happen if you only killed um, boss monsters and let everybody else go. Hmm. Blah blah blah. The smell makes me want to eliminate, eliminate you. Okay. That's simple to evade a bit. Bit simple. And now your friend is I'll chop you in half. Still simple to evade. Suffer. Simple to evade! I ain't been hit by your bullshit yet. Done. What? How did you avoid my trap? And what but me is there any left for me? What do you tell Pyrus? I ate it, I left it. Left it. Really? Wowie! You resisted the, the flavor of my home cooking cooked pasta just so you could share it with me. Free fear not, human eye. Master Chef Papyrus will make you all the pasta you could ever want. <laughs> I actually really respect Papyrus because nothing gets him down, no matter what. Human! Hmm. How do I say this? You are taking a long time so to, to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look like to more look like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. The, now the solution is different. And also unusual. My, as usual, my bro my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. I, the great papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, you feel free to try the puzzle yourself. 
I'll try not to give the answer away. Okay. Okay, this looks good. For me, at least. I think I solved- yep, yeah, I solved it. Well, you solved it, and you did it! All without my help, in impossible! I am impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I am sure you'll love the next puzzle, then. It might even be too much for you! <laughs> well... Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help. Which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. Cool. Great, great, this part. Hey! It is the human! It's the human! You're going to love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Alpheus! You see these tiles? Once I throw the switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are... impassable. You cannot... which means you cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles are electric. They will shock you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. You will smell like oranges. You will smell... They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you... If you like to, but if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if you are... If a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. Are soapy. You will slide to the next tile. Also, however, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They do not do anything. Step on them all. Step on them all. You can like as you like. However, how is that? You understand? Yes, of course. Great! Then there's no... Th then there's one thing left. This puzzle is absolutely random! When I flip this switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before! And not even I know the solution! <laughs> Ready? And it's just gonna be red and pink. Red and pink, because Metaton is that damn machine over there. Yep. I am so done with this shit, sons. Beyblade, Beyblade, let it rip. Let's fight an epic battle. Face off and spin the metal. Actually, that's spaghetti from earlier. It wasn't too bad for my brother. Since he started cooking. Since he started cooking lessons, he's been improving a lot. I bet if he keeps it up, Next year, he'll even make something edible. The machine isn't working. Ugh. It's a pile of mush snow. The snow can always be broken down and rebuilt into something more useful. This simple fact fills you with determination. Okay, um, this, then this, then this, then this one, that one too, that one, that one, then this, and this, and this, and this, and that, yep, did it. 
I did it. it. <laughs> I had a little hat on and everything. I was about to say, where'd those little eyes go? Say, are you following me? No. Thought you were following me, buddy. I'm just trying to see if anything's going to attack me. I don't think it will. Snow poof. It's a snow poof. Looking for the one with the money in it. It's probably going to be the next to last one. Yep. And now for the dog. Now everybody's going to have to forgive me for this. I'm going to wind up probably killing this creature. Because, well... Yeah, one said that that's how I do the neutral route. Am I just letting myself get hit out of guilt? Probably. This is your final and most dangerous challenge. Behold, the gauntlet of deadly turmoil. <sighs> when I say the word, it will fully activate. Cannons will fire, spikes will spin, will swing, blades will slice. Each part will swing violently up and down and flailing your way. Only the... Only the twist challenge. Only the tasty taste of victory will remain. Are you ready? Because I am about to defense. Mm, well... What are you waiting? What's the hold up? Hold up? What hold up? I am about to activate it now! Son. <laughs> That's, um... Doesn't look very activated. Well, well, this challenge, it seems maybe too easy to defeat the human with. Yeah, we can't use this one. I am a skeleton with standards. My puzzles are fair. And my traps are completely cooked. Are completely cooked. But this method is too direct. No class at all. Anyway, it's gone. It goes. Away it goes. Phew. What are you looking at? This was another dastardly victory, decisive victory for the pirates. <laughs> I don't know what my brother's going to do now. If I were you, I would make sure I understood blue attacks. Yep, 100% not doing the genocide route, because, well, if I was, I wouldn't have to wonder. And let's put the butterscotch pie in there. Stick in there, too. Bandage in there, too. Let's get as much health as possible. And that'll be 80 to stay. And we're sleeping, having a nightmare about when we cut down Toriel and her prime. And I'm pretty sure that thing snoring over there is just one creature, one big creature. Oh, I just realized they're snoring the Undertale theme. I'm not gonna lie, they're actually making me fucking tired. 
Hiya! You look well rested. You look like you had a great sleep, which is incredible because you were only up there for about two minutes. Here is your money back. You can pay me if you're going to stay overnight. I want to see if this ups my health even more. Let's check the stats. Okay, I guess that's good. We haven't been captured yet, so we can't go in there. I don't want to hurt the virus, so... I mean, I don't want to kill him. Maybe I might have to hurt him, but human, allow me to... Allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover. The admission for... The admiration for puzzles. Solving skills. The desire to have someone... To have a cool and smart person looking... Thinking you are cool. These feelings. These must be your feelings right now. I can't hardly imagine it must be like... I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am great. I am very great. I don't even wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great papyrus, will be your... No, no. This is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can finally fulfill. Then I can fulfill my long, my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, praised. That's Papyrus, the newest member of the Rife God. <laughs> Papyrus blocks away, um, light hit. So you're serious then. Let's see if you can handle this. I'm blue now, aren't I? Whoa! You're blue now. It's my blue attack. <laughs> Behold! Okay, gotta dodge. How much higher can you jump, human? You can jump pretty, pretty well. Whew! I'm pretty skilled at jumping. He says as he takes damage. I can almost taste my future popularity. Whoa. You're not gonna be able to trick me. Whoa. Praise unpassable spaghettis. No, I'm actually a fan of spaghetti in real life, right, guys? Spaghetti's great, man. Undying will be really proud of me. Imagine if Papyrus died in battle, Undying would blame herself because she did tell him to capture a human. The king will... will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile.
I believe the king would do that anyway. My brother will... He will... Won't change very much, actually. Whoa! I'm actually dodging a lot of these. I'm surprised I am. Well, I know if people seriously like me. How will I know if people seriously, seriously like me? Yeah. You just gotta assume, man. It's like somebody, one of my friends told me. You gotta take care of yourself. You gotta worry about yourself first. Someone like you is really rare. Wow, thanks, man. I'm spoken for. I don't think they'll let... I don't think they'll let you go. You're captured and sent away. Whoa. Ah! Who cares? Give up! Give up! Or face my special attack! Soon I will use my special attack. I knew that was coming. Not long, and I will use that special attack. Oh, we will. We will. This is your last chance before my special attack. Oh, nice special attack. What the heck? That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that phone. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Oh, well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Here's an absolutely normal attack. Absolutely normal, my ass! It's normal enough to beat my damn ass, apparently. The dog hit me! Okay, cool. Dude. Bone on skateboard. Oh, sweet mother in the morning! Ah! Well, it's clear you can't defeat me. Yeah, I can see you. You're shaking in your boots. Therefore, I, the great papyrus, affected to pity you. I will spare you, human. Now your chance to attack, to accept my mercy. I wouldn't attack him if he gave me mercy, usually. <laughs> I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undying's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard. My friend quality will remain singular. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess 
I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow! I have friends! And who knows? And who knew that all I needed to do to make them was to give people awful puzzles and fight them? You taught me a lot, human! A hobby, great, you... I humbly grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cave. Then you can reach the capital. Cross the barrier and cross the barrier. That's the magic seal trapping us all underground. In anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit except someone with a powerful soul like yours. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with a with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all the monsters. He is, well, he's a big fairy pusher. Everybody loves that guy. I can. I am Sincerely, if you, I'm certain, if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyways, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and hang out. <laughs> I can fly! Well, guys, I guess I'm going to end the episode now because it's already a fucking hour long. <laughs> I'm going to end this episode also because I feel fucking exhausted. I haven't been sleeping at all. I'm trying to study how to fucking do the fucking neutral route. So, this is where I bid you guys good night. So, good night.